Bobby Dazzler, written by Margaret Wilde, read by me. Bobby could jump and bounce and skip. She could hop on her left leg and on her right leg. But she could not do the splits. Never mind, said Koala. But Bobby minded a lot. Bobby could walk on her heels. She could walk on her toes. She could balance on a fallen log. She could whirl and twirl. But she could not do the splits. Never mind, said Wombat. But Bobby minded a lot. She could stand on her head. She could do handsprings. She could do somersaults, forwards and backwards. But she could not do the splits. Never mind, said Possum. But Bobby minded a lot. One morning Bobby said, This time I will do it. I will, I will, I will. She closed her eyes. She took a deep breath. And she slid and slid and slid. Look, she said, I've done the splits. Dazzling, Bobby, dazzling, everyone said. But Bobby couldn't get up. She was stuck. Oh, dear, said Koala, Wombat, and Possum. But Bobby didn't mind, not at all. Because now that she'd done the splits once, she knew she could do them again perfectly. And after lots and lots and lots of practice, so could Koala, Wombat, and Possum. The End